Let's look the day together. How do we correctly inflate the tires on our vehicles? It might seem to be super easy and clear to most of you, but believe me, I saw so many tires coming to the shop inflated to 50, 60, 65 PSI on the no normal small passenger vehicles that I decided that we have to make video about this. Anytime I saw these on over inflated tires, if it was 40 or 60 or something, I was able in most of the cases to read that the maximum pressure which cannot be exceeded was 40 or 60 PSI. So I assume the people looked on the wall of the tire and they just inflated it to the max which it says on the wall. What we know is that the correct tire pressure is most of the time displayed right here. It's either right here on this side on the sticker or it's right here. And looking at that sticker I can see that the pressure for the front is 35 psi cold, rear 35 psi cold. So what I do, I need to have some nice precise gauge for the tire pressures. I really like this one, this is my favorite. And I just go and undo the cap, take it off, zero the gauge put it on and briefly, firmly attach it to it. And I can read that is perfectly 30 PSI. So now I have chance to add the air, measure it again, put it to the zero, re-measure it, and make sure there is 35 PSI in the tire. This is the method which I prefer to use because I really need to lose some weight. So guys, thank you for your time. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.